Not just the Blue Angels that are performing at the homecoming show. Also flying today and tomorrow, the Aeroshell team, four T-6s, the plane that back in World War II was the final test before pilots were ready for war. And today, as the airplane showed off their maneuverability, they took on some guests along for the ride, including the CW-55's Haley Minogue. I bet you're wondering how I got right here. Honey, can we go now? It all started at NAS Pensacola with four highly skilled pilots, the Aeroshell Aerobatic Team. Buckled in, headset on, and a thumbs up. Then we're off. The Aeroshell team flies 25 shows a year, but the homecoming show is special to them. It's the classic event, and the Blue Angels are top dog. That's the voice of Gene McNeely, the Navy veteran who's flying this plane I'm in. He tells me to hold on, it's time for a loop. And before I can even have time to mentally prepare... <laughs> then we're straight into a barrel roll. It's a maneuver similar to what the Blue Angels do, except they're in jets, and we're in a single propeller plane. We're almost there, but we're not up there. We don't compete with those big boys. <laughs> then we're gliding over the beautiful beaches of Pensacola. For a minute, I stop shooting video on my phone and just take it all in. Then, before I know it, the trip is over. But once we're on the ground, I have a chance to really talk to McNeely. I wanted to know, as a veteran, flying on Veterans Day, what he thinks about people who serve our country. We're so grateful for them. We wouldn't be here today if it wasn't uh, for our, our military. Uh, they're, they're awesome people. I got to serve in the Navy, and uh, I wouldn't take anything for that. I got a signed picture of the team, and then that was it. But the way 4G's feels, and the way Pensacola looks from thousands of feet in the sky, isn't something I'll soon forget. Reporting aboard NAS Pensacola, Haley Minogue, the CW55 News at 9. And the pilot that Haley rode with, Gene McNeely, he races his other T6 at the Reno Air Races, and he's finished in the top five every year since 1986.